exactly the same thing as addition. You're basically just taking the two functions and subtracting them. So I'd have x squared plus 1 minus the square root of x. I can't do anything else with that. right? So now we go to the domain. Is there any numbers that we cannot add, plug into our rule and get an output? Again, the domain is going to be the same. We can't plug in any numbers that are less than 0. So x has to be greater than or equal to 0. Or you could write it as 0 comma infinity. Now, f, f of g minus 2 is basically, you could do like I did before, just take this and plug in 2. Or you could also do it like this. Realize that it's really f of 2 minus g of 2. Really, you're taking the evaluation of f, f of x of for 2, and you're subtracting g of x for 2. So it's really 2 squared plus 1 minus the square root of 2. Well, 2 squared is 4. 4 plus 1 is 5. So it's 5 times the square root of 2. So if you were to plug in 2 into the difference of the two functions, you would get the exact same answer I just got, just a different way of doing it. Okay? But the main important thing I want you guys to understand from this is 